According to our intel, there's a cartel death truck that collects corpses across San Mateo and delivers them to someone called El Pozolero. Intercept the truck and force the driver to give up El Pozolero's location. the truck. We need this fucker alive. He's already got a load in back for the goddamn bodies. Shit balls. Say the word. It's clear. Uh, How you guys I'm unarmed! Up? I'm unarmed! <clears throat> you El Pozolero. For serious? Fuck no, I'm not that Diablo. I just drive the truck, way. Nada más. Tell me his name and where to find him. His name's Raul something. Raul Morillo. You sure you want me to tell you where he is? Motherfucker, tell me where El Pozolero is. I ran out of patience two days ago. All right, I'll tell you where he is. Pero you wish you'd never found out. Okay, just Bowman, this is Nomad. The driver gave us El Pozolero's real name, Raul Morillo. He also gave up Pozzolero's location. Outstanding. I'll run Murillo's name and send you whatever background I can find. This one's weird, Bowman. These cartel goons are staying away from El Pozzolero like he's got the plague. That might be why there's such little chatter about him. Be careful. There's a lot of unknowns here. Just make sure he's alive. Otherwise, we'll never get confirmation on these missing people. Just got a file transfer from Bowman. Looks like she was able to dig... When I was a kid, we used to live over the train tracks. Every time a train went past, I would run into my mother's bed, and she'd assure me there was no such thing as monsters. She was such a liar. El Pozolero, also known as the Stewmaker. Sometimes the cartel needs a dead body to completely disappear without a trace. In such cases, they ship the cadavers off to San Mateo. The first thing El Pozolero does is place the bodies inside a barrel which he fills with caustic soda, sodium hydroxide, then covers the drums, stirring occasionally. After 24 hours, there's nothing left but a thick sludge, a stew. He pours this into a pit. Any leftover teeth or bone fragments, he smashes into dust. Last year, more than 300 people disappeared in San Mateo. Their families have no idea if their loved ones are alive or dead. They can't have proper burials. They can't have closure. The only one who knows what truly happened to these people is El Pozolero, the monster who melted them.